it is a cherished Wisconsin lake, but now there's a proposal to cut off one of three public access points. Our Jason Calvi explains the proposal that's floating in Hartford. This is just a little part of paradise for all of us that live here. For decades, you could stroll down the town of Hartford's 2nd Street and drop your boat, kayak, or pole into Pike Lake. This doesn't look like much, right? But this is a lot to a lot of people. The road runs through two lots. One homeowner owns a lot here and a lot here. And she says that there's already a boat launch just 200 feet down there. It's shorter, it's wider, it's uh, less steep. It's, and it's been maintained by the town. So it's, it's a better access point. This is not a very good one. We don't use this. We use that one. And across the lake is a state park with a newly built boat launch. Tom Savage's wife, Tammy Young, owns the two lots surrounding the drive. She's asking the town to officially abandon the road. The land would then revert to Young. She says her lawyer researched it and found no documentation the land was ever handed over to the town. It's what's called a prescriptive easement which means that probably some prior owner um, let people use it for 20 years or more, and then the town took it over. The survey maps, though, show Young's two lots ending just before the access road. Neighbors say it should stay as the town's property so everyone has access, including firefighters here where there's no fire hydrants. It scares me because of you know what happens with access for fire department if there's a fire in one of these houses in the neighborhood. It was a big catch for Scott Tyler to be a couple houses down from a spot where he can ice fish and kayak. It's gorgeous out here. In the town of Hartford, Jason Calvi, Fox 6 News. On Monday, the town of Hartford board will host a public hearing on whether to abandon the road. If they approve it, then the State Department of Natural Resources would also have to give its okay.